Hi, and welcome to April 24th. Thank you for clicking on this video, guys. It means the world to me. Now, this game is going to be about a little bit of VHS genre, a little bit of case study about a murder mystery and all that stuff. So naturally, I'm excited about it. So let's not delay and just jump right into it and see what this game is actually going to offer us, shall we? The Wicked. Ooh. Oh. Is this a basement? Oh, I'm hearing things already. <laughs> Ooh, strong start then. All right, I get it. Oh, I have a TV, so I'm not a prisoner at least. Unless I am a prisoner to my own thoughts. Man, it's dark. Why? What's going on? Okay, looks like a habitat more than a prison, which is good. I thought I was captured, actually. I'm hearing things down there, but I don't want to go there. I'll, I just want to leave. Can I do that? It's a little claustrophobic in here, man. Oh. Oh, that's not good. Hello? Where are these noises coming? Oh. You hear that whispering? Oh, no, 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 no. What's up? Can I leave? Yes! Oh! Why? What the hell? Man! Oh, he shut the door on me. Rude. All right. Let's take it easy then. Can I just go back to sleep? Is this an I- Oh, hi, hi. Hello? Oh, you want me to take the axe? She shouldn't have done that in your bed. Did she poop in my bed? She deserves to be punished. Uh, all right. Dear Ben, you've been living in the basement for months and haven't come out. You're going crazy and dragging us along. The kids and I don't understand what's going on with you. You've become aggressive and you're taking all of your anger out on us. Alice is sick. It's hard for her to live in uh, such an environment. And Jacob is still too young. I don't want him to get hurt. Know that we have uh, the right to live without you. I tried to discuss everything with you in a normal setting, but you just don't make contact. I just want you to know that we have someone who will take care of us. All you have to do is let us go. Let us do this. Sincerely, Evelyn. Phew, okay. This is hinting at some very, very dark themes. Oh, it is what it is, I guess. Here's the axe and there's the family upstairs. Let's go. <laughs> Oof, man. How come did I get sucked into this? Hello, man. Tall guy. How tall are you? Eight feet? At least seven. For sure, for sure. Right? Unless I'm just tiny. Yeah, I am probably tiny. I'm reaching that doorknob, so, yeah, that's no normal human size. All right, going in. Hello? Oh, I go up. Oh, there's another set of stairs. Okay, going up, I guess. But they're sleeping, aren't they? That's kind of cowardly to be doing that while somebody's asleep, but... Let's do it, I guess. Not that I want to, but it's what the game demands of me. Hello? I can't get in there. I'm hearing some baby stuff from here. Hello, Mr. Baby. How are you doing today? Yes, it's a pleasure to meet you too. Oh, oh so cute. Well, boss baby is sleeping. Oh. Hello? What's that? Oh, the door just opened on its own. Can I go in? Huh? Can I go in this? No? Okay. Maybe I open these doors. Open. Open wide. If I need to run, just in case, you know. Okay. Oh, gee. What, what the hell, man? I know. I got it. Oh. Somebody's running a marathon in there. I'm guessing that's the bedroom. Right. Hey, my name's Sean Miller, and I'm conducting a journalistic investigation of a brutal murder on the outskirts of the city that occurred on April 24th. I want to find the true cause of this crime and find answers to all questions. Well, good luck to you. Who? Chapter 3 already? I've been playing for like 5 minutes. Oh. I've been watching some tapes. That's a big pile. Man, okay. 
Well, where are we? Oh. Am I at the crime scene itself? It seems like it. There's that police tape. Hmm. Oh boy, this is scary. There's a bunch of tapes here. What am I looking for? Oh, there it is. What's that? I, newspaper. On April 24th, a brutal murder took place in a house on the outskirts of the city. A man killed his entire family with an axe. The accused himself called the police and was arrested on the spot. The man testifies and says that he was influenced by a certain man in a hat and that he forced him to commit this crime. The police have no further comment. Well, that's just dumb as hell because we saw that the man in a hat was just telling him to do things. He was enforcing him. Pieces of me. Okay. Let's uh, shove that in there, huh? Let's see what that do. Oh, I'm hearing things. Yeah, it must be the man in the head, huh? Pieces of me. Well, I got that. Yes. Show me more. Oh. Roping the knobs. Okay, flug. Let's go. Whatever you want to do with those. Why would you seal the house? Whoa. Oh, this is getting worse. What's in there? Hello? Oh, oh, oh! What was that for? Somebody's in there. Okay, well, I'm just gonna explore. Hi, Teddy. You doing all right? Can I leave? No. No way, why? I need to look for a knife. Oh, hi, beardo baby. Oh, look at this guy. Oh, what happened to you? You're no son of mine. That's not my baby, is it? Well, we have a knife here. Let's uh, grab that. Oh, hey, oh, 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 that's some baby noises. Does my baby talk? This is scary. I don't like this. I'm confused too, by the way. I have no idea. Okay, well, I guess we're leaving. We cut this and, uh, uh... Get the hell out of here, huh? Don't we? Yep. Hey, I'm hearing something really bad in there. Oh. Oh. Oh, I can't leave, can I? Okay, well, we are sealed in. I don't know who sealed the house this nicely, but somebody did it. Oh, hi. Oh, this baby is eating something. <laughs> ah! Scared me. Creepy baby! Is that what my kid turned into? Jesus Christ. Okay, well... Can I remove that? Can we get inside? Oh! What was that? Oh, just it was just Jesus. Okay. That was not Jesus. That was definitely not Jesus. Who is it out there? Don't trouble an old man! Hello? Oh. There's a lock in here. All right, Nick. Well, I can take that. Where do I go? I think I'll go back to the laundry room or whatever this was. Looked like a laundry room. What is this? It is an actual laundry room on the first floor. Why would you have that? Oh, there's a crowbar here. Why would it be in the first floor? Oh, oh, why? What the hell? Why are you running around? Calm down. The floorboards are creaky. Come on. I'm going downstairs. Oh boy. Is the whole house like balanced on one tree or something? Because it's shaking a lot. What am I hearing? Why is the cross upside down? Hello? Hey, hey, don't open it. Oh, who was that? Who was just walking? Don't walk. I'll break your legs. Huh? Okay, well, I'm gonna... Oh, I'm locked in here. Oh. Yeah, prepare yourself. Where's my crowbar? Oh. Okay, she gave me a key. Well, that's a helpful ghost. All right, I'm sorry about that. I don't want to threaten you or whatever. You did scare me a little there. There's a cross on the chair. I don't know why. Can I open that? I think so, yes. Hello. Hello, my name is, uh... Mr. Fleepster. I'm gonna take your floop. Oh, what's going on? Okay, nothing good. Some people be knocking. 
Hmm. Okay. This is bad. This is very bad. Oh, somebody knocking from inside the coffin. Okay, that, that makes a whole lot of sense. I thought it was a door or something. Right, well, do I open it? I don't want to. There's somebody in there. And I think they're alive. Guys. That's not good, is it? Okay, I'm just gonna sit down here, maybe? No? Okay. What am I supposed to do? Oh, I'm hearing something from that room. Can I open this? Oh. Okay. Yeah. Well, that's all that was missing, I guess. Somebody be moving furniture around. Right. Oh, yep. Here I can go in from here. Ooh. There is a phone ringing. What's up? Hello? There's a little thing. A paper. A little shelf with a hammer and ropes. And a bunch of boxes and trunks. Okay, I'll keep that in mind. Whatever that means. So where's this shelf? Is it important? Do I have to go somewhere for it? Oh, oh, oh. What the? Okay, oh, yeah, I'm coming for you. I'll burn you down, heathen. What are you? Oh, you're just a kid. Are you okay? Well, I can't go there. Well, you're not scary. Hmm. Maybe I go here? Oh, oh, check this out. I went all the way back for this outside of the basement. Hello? Why did you turn? That's not good. That's not very nice. Turn back. Don't look at me. Do I have anything here? Do I just go back to bed? Is this nightmare gonna end? Please. Stop. Stop staring at me. What happened to your legs? Ah! Ah! Well, that was just rude. I'm going up. Oh, this, brother. There's nothing nice about oh, this place. I just want to leave, man. So what am I supposed to do? Uh, nothing here. Same old room with same old story. Okay, well, has something changed here then? Tie the ropes to the doors. Well, sometimes I need a knife to cut these. Oh, stop! This is scaring the hell out of me. I'm on my toes anyway. Okay, well, th th that does it, right? Close and board up the coffin. Oh, now she's in the coffin. Great. I wonder. Is that my daughter or wife? I don't know. I can't tell if it's a kid. But it seems like it's my daughter. Need to find a cross and put it on the coffin. All right. I think I know where it is. Um, it was in one of the chairs, right? Oh, none of these. What chair was it on? Was it on the other room? Was oh, she's crying in the coffin? Kind of feel bad, but it is what it is. I'll do what the game tells me to. Uh, this chair, yes. Oh, where did it go? It was supposed to be there. Hmm. Hey, what's that? There's a little paper. A red book on a bookcase. Well, I don't remember seeing a bookcase. Huh. Okay, I'll keep an eye out for a bookcase thing. Bookshelf. Oh, there it is. <laughs> That's a red book. Does that open the safe? You're gonna find out. Oh, oh! oh, man! Calm down. Oh, there's a cross. Somebody put it in the safe. Oh, ah, ah. you weird baby! Nine one one. My baby's trying to kill me. Somebody get this guy. My family's harassing me because I killed them. They need to get a life. Okay, there you go. Sleep in peace. You're gonna die. Shut up. That's the dead one. Where are you? Look at yourself in the coffin. Oh. What's what's ringing? I thought it was the phone. Kind of forgot how a phone sounds. The Touch of Evil. Short and sweet name. 
Whew. Man, that was intense for no reason. Well, uh, okay. Well, can I pick that up? No. Okay. Well, good luck to you picking that hammer. Apparently, it's from Thor. You can't. Well, that cross is upside down. Mm. No like. Need to lock the door with the chair. Well, there's a chair here. Where did it go? Where's the chair? Oh, there it is. Come here, you. The dim lighting in this room is not helping me. Am I hearing a baby again? Hello, shitty baby. There's a little tape here. Proof of death. All right, let's play this one and see what that does. Proof of death. Yeah, got it. Oh, what the? That's disgusting. Oh, he did kill his wife and the man she was seeing behind his back. Oh, look at these footprints going somewhere for printing their way out. Hey, guy. You like your new bed? How you feeling? Maybe not so good. Maybe a little soggy. Yeah, so what am I supposed to do in this room? No, seriously, what am I supposed to do? Do I... Well... Rats are eating the bodies. Which is kind of grim, I gotta say, but... And there's the proof. Not just death, but of cheating as well, apparently. Alrighty. <laughs> Whew, yeah. I don't know, I can't pick these evidences up or whatever. So... What am I supposed to do? I can't leave. Can't open these doors either. Nice makeup stuff there. Oh, there's a little seven evidence there as well. What's that? I saw- I can pick it up! Yes, give me, give me, give me, give me! Do I have to hack these bodies? I wonder. Tell me. Do I do it? Well, I can't do it to this guy. Apparently, I start with my wife, maybe. Oh. Apparently not. Then what? Do I open... Oh, it's for the chain! Of course! I went too grim there. Oh, A baby walking outside. Hey, kid. Who taught you to walk? That's not fair. I didn't walk until I was 70 years old. Why are you so quick? You're only seven months old. Piece of crap. Oh, this is boarded again. Now let's go this way then. Uncharted territory. Which ends here. Great. There's a safe. Need to find uh, the password. Okay. I'm assuming the password goes here and the safe opens. Or the door opens. I don't know. I mean, this, is, this is just confusing. Right. Maybe I go upstairs. 3C. Anything else? Hmm. Nothing. Once written on the wall, I'm just looking. Okay. Maybe I go up again. Oh. I'm hearing more Goo Goo Gaga. This baby's kind of. Ah! This baby is scary. Stop it, baby. I can open this door with a bolt cutter. Man, I had a saw. Are you dumb? Can I open this? I need a key. You need a bolt cutter for that as well, actually, but all right. Man, this guy needs a different tool for everything. Maybe use that axe you used for three people. Jesus. Weirdo. Oh, three B. So something, three, three and something. Okay. Hmm. Nothing downstairs, apparently. Which is bad. Kind of running out of options here, Bucko. Uh, I need a number. Something 33 three something, apparently. So I need one more number at least. Hey, guy. There's a guy in there. What are you pointing at? So 433 three something. Let's try 4331. Three, three, I doubt there will be three threes in there. So 4332. Three, three, Four, three, three, four. Four, three, three, five. Come on. 
Oh, yes! What, what did it open? Not the doors, for sure. Then... It is the safe! Yay, let's go! I'm so happy! Open this! What is that? Dear Ben, I can't live like this anymore. I want to get a divorce and sell the house. My torment has become unbearable, and I need freedom. Please give me the opportunity to start a new chapter in my life. Oh, he sure did. You started the chapter called The End in your life. Oh. Hello, who are you? I wonder who this guy is. He has a key in his mouth. Oh, where were you pointing at, buddy? Who is this guy? Hmm. Well, I don't know what he was pointing at either. He's breathing weirdly. I can hear him breathing. He's alive. Oh, oh, oh. Hi, baby. Oh, what is this guy doing bowing to my baby? Oh, that's not my baby. That's a demon baby. Oh, what happened? Oh, look at this. Oh, check this out. <laughs> it's called game developer magic. It's pretty cool, huh? Well, where are we going with this? Uh, I got a key, so I should be able to unlock this. Right. Once I go in... Nothing here. Can I open that? You're going this way, boys. Oh, I'm hearing the baby room now. Can I enter? Let's go in. Hello. Oh. Oh. What's this place? I saw the bolt cutter. Can I pick that up? Yay. A wheelchair. Oh, there's another girl here. Oh, that's my daughter, isn't it? There's something behind the door. I need to find something to open it with. Man, why did you hurt your daughter of all people? Okay, there's something here. What is it? Is it the paper? Okay, here we go. A leaf from the diary. Dear diary, mom and dad were fighting again today. If I wasn't a burden, I could help them with uh, little Jacob. He requires a lot of attention and I give them a lot of trouble. It hurts me to look at them and see how much they suffer because of me and Jacob. If I hadn't been there, my parents would have had a much happier life. They wouldn't have to worry about my health. I feel useless and unnecessary, and I'd like to be the best daughter for them, Alice. So it is my daughter. Well, Alice, let me tell you something. You weren't a burden. You just had shitty parents. There's her head. Oh boy. Yeah, this is just dark and kind of depressing, honestly. I don't like it anymore. I don't like this anymore, you know? It's a different thing with the spouse because she was cheating and like, you know... I don't know. What? What was that for? Come on. Oh, Dude. Alright. Oh! Whoa, oh, shh! Give me a heart attack! Ugh! Now this, this place is not nice. I'm not liking how dark it got suddenly. Okay. Can we undo this with the bolt cutter we can have? Okay. <laughs> and back to the crowbar. Yeah. Look at that. I couldn't have kept it with me. I threw it back in the laundry room for some reason. Okay, let's get the kill on. Oh! What is your problem? Weirdo. Okay, what am I hearing? Don't do that. No. Yeah, we gotta open this one up. So what's in here? <laughs> That's the thing. Yay. That's this is what I used. Oh. Do I leave? Okay, I think I'm going back. What's this doll? It's scary as hell. It's like right around the corner. It just creeps you out. Okay, I can't open that. So where does this take? Oh! What the hell, man? Creep! Oh, that's where the journalist is. He's watching the tapes. Oh. This hat man has surely mixed time together or something. What happened? 
Those past and present colliding. There's no way out? Well, I got that much, yeah. I understand that. That's not what my question was. How did a guy from the past show up in the present or something with the VHS? Okay, whatever. He's not here, so I'm not worried. I'm hearing things. A lot of them. Ha, ah, baby! Man, this is so dark, I can't see anything. Right. Thank you, baby. Thanks for help. I'm leaving. Oh, this place. I'm leaving. Okay, open. Jeez. What's wrong with the doors? I keep opening them and... Is this a bug? I swear if this is a... Doesn't sound like a bug. Apparently I'm making progress. Oh, there's a brick wall. Oh wow, that's just rude. Oh! Why? You weirdo! Okay, open up. Do it. Yay, I like to do it, do it. I like to do it, do it. Oh, where am I? This is a little room. Huh? Oh, hello. Are those my kids? It feels like there's my daughter and there's the baby. The baby just turned into a demon or something. I feel like the hat man possessed this guy. Huh, right. Maybe. It doesn't say that I did take the baby away as well. Maybe he's alive and possessed. Maybe he ran away. Oh! Huh. Okay. What does that mean? Huh? All right. Well, I don't understand any of that. Oh, here we are. Finish your movie. Get on the chair. I have completed this investigation, but unfortunately I will not be able to publish it. This house is a source of madness. It has consumed me. I wanted to find the truth out, but instead I found death. It's all about the man in the hat. He possesses his victims and makes them do terrible things. I can't resist him. Sean Miller. So the journalist goes boom. Okay. Right, well... The journalist just got looped into this thing for no reason. <laughs> but now they have an actual loop ready for this guy. So... Oh, hi! Okay, well, yeah. I guess... People do whatever this guy says. How do I get up on top of this? I just climbed, right? Yay. Okay, we're going. Sayonara, boys. See you in the next video. <laughs> well, this was the game. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Thank you for watching. I feel like it, it went a little dark on the themes. And I usually don't do a lot of games which have this dark of a theme. So this sure was a new experience. Although I'm fine, like mentally I'm okay. I'm, I don't think I'm gonna you know, have to be traumatized after this order, but still, it just feels like it's not right for the channel or the kind of content I'm trying to make. I'm trying to make, like, you know, funny or, like, lighthearted horror sometimes, you know, just to, um, like, you know, if, if you're scared of watching horror stuff, I want my channel to be a place where, like, you can sit down and watch it and, like, enjoy it because I'm there with you and whatever, right? And even if you are not scared, you know, I, I just want to make content that people enjoy, but... Some themes, I think, would be a little too much for the channel, not for me, but, you know, it is what it is, I guess. Either way, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you for watching. It means the world to me, guys. I will see you in the next video of Water I Play. If you like this video, please hit the like button, and if you're new here, kindly subscribe. I'll see you in the next video of Water I Play, as I've said. Take care of yourself. Until then, be nice to people, be nice to animals, guys, and peace.